Uh, well, I have chosen the University of Kent due to something that I would personally call uh, the course coherence. Um, what do I mean by that? Well, the modules themselves link one another throughout the years, uh, from year one, two, four, and I believe this is absolutely necessary in a physics degree to be sure that you build up year after year, foundation after foundation. First step in becoming a scientist will be to gather your first research experience. Uh, an integrated master's course, however, does not sacrifice the theoretical background that is often necessary in performing research, but also gives you a chance to conduct real research with an excellent range of resources that we have here available at Kent. <laughs> How does the course challenge me? Uh, well, due to the calibre of a lot of our lecturers, many of them will have, will have worked at uh, NASA or ESA, they do bear high standards. And in the end, it is not just about the coherence, but the necessity to, pull, to put in the work uh, that they expect you to do. Even if it means going from the library 9 to 6, you have to do it. In the end, that's a physics degree. I'm currently finalizing a report on uh, the initiative called Project Starshot, uh, which is an initiative to send the first interstellar probe, a dedicated interstellar probe, into the Alpha Centauri system, which is four light years away. I'm currently discussing the feasibility against other proposed spacecraft systems. Um, and, and as it turns out, we can achieve it within the next 20 or 30 years using the technology that we currently have. Well, at the University of Kent, our facilities range from good to excellent. Uh, we do possess our own Beacon Observatory, which we have founded over two years ago, so this bears um, a lot of links to our course, wherever we learn about CCD, the types of detectors, or perform data analysis with them. The campus itself has a lot of study spaces. We are talking over 10 different study hubs and a brand new renovated library, which bears over a thousand spaces, so I, I personally feel there's always some space on the campus. Take this seriously and use your time efficiently. A physics or an astrophysics degree is not something one can take without a lot of consideration. But in the end, number one, it's going to be rewarding and number two, people are there to help you in the end and you will be in a very good position for anything you want in life.